in the past few hours we have been taken by surprise with some news. The revelation of a new series in the Game of Thrones universe. A prequel that many thought had been cancelled, but today, HBO officially announced its production. This revelation comes after a week of rumors about a prequel, which will tell the story of Aegon the Conqueror. Apparently, the story we will see next in the Game of Thrones universe will be the story of Duncan the Tall and his small squire, Egg. A Knight of the Seven Kingdoms, the Hedge Knight. A story full of important events about the Game of Thrones universe. So if you want to know everything that was mentioned in this announcement, and what we could expect from this new prequel, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Welcome. To the Three-Eyed Raven. This news was first published on the official Twitter of HBO Max, in which you can read the following words. A century before Game of Thrones, there was Sir Duncan the Tall in his squire egg. Produced by George R. R. Martin, Ira Parker, Ryan Condal, and Vince Girardis. A Knight of the Seven Kingdoms. The Hedge Knight has received a straight-to-series order. A teaser trailer for this series was released in this one, and in the teaser which lasts just about 8 seconds, we get to see several interesting things. First we are shown a map of Westeros, focusing on the area of Harrenhal and King's Landing. And then the title of the series is shown. A Knight of the Seven Kingdoms, The Hedge Knight. This confirms that the universe of Game of Thrones has begun to expand into stories beyond the throne, and the eras to which we are accustomed. The story of Duncan the Tall and Egg is a very interesting one that we have not yet covered in this channel. The official synopsis of the series reads as follows. A century before the events of Game of Thrones, two unlikely heroes roamed Westeros. A naive young man but a brave knight. Sir Duncan the Tall and his diminutive squire Egg. Set in a time when the Targaryen bloodline still held the Iron Throne, and the memory of the last dragon had not yet faded from living memory. Great destinies, powerful enemies, and dangerous exploits await these unlikely and incomparable friends. One of the interesting things about the story of Duncan the Tall and Egg, is that Egg's real name is Aegon Targaryen V. So we won't stray that far from the House of the Dragon. After all, this universe is about this family. This would be the second prequel to Game of Thrones, although I think it is time to stop calling it prequels, and see it as a shared universe, as we already know from the pre-production of the Jon Snow series, the current House of the Dragon, the story of Aegon the Conqueror, and others that are on the table, show that it is no longer about simple spin-offs, but a cinematic universe is being built. We cannot forget there are also other series and movies in production, such as Nymeria's story, Corlys Valerian's story, and even an animated movie of Yeti's regions. We know that some of these movies and series were shelved, but others will see the light as in the case of this series of The Hedge Knight. But why did this announcement come as a surprise? And what happened to the series of Jon Snow? Today was the Warner Brothers and Discovery press conference, where they announced several of the new projects that we will see on their platform. Here they announced other series, such as the Harry Potter adaptation, something we will talk about in my secondary channel which I will drop in the description, and the revelation of the day, the new series in the Game of Thrones universe. Now, many are saying that this means the Jon Snow series has been shelved, that possibly the stories will only focus on the past. However, in an interview with George Martin in 2016, he was asked about what stories we might see adapted on TV, and he talked about the story of the Hedge Knight, saying the following. There's no shortage of material. But which of those million stories would be the best film project a prequel set during Robert's Rebellion? or a sequel set after the events of the current series? Martin has a suggestion. 
the most natural sequel would be an adaptation of my Dunk and Egg stories, Martin points out. The Dunk and Egg stories are a series of novels set in the same world as A Song of Ice and Fire. With the difference that they are set about 90 years before Tyrion, Daenerys, and Arya's time. The stories follow a hedge knight, a nomad, who owns no land. Sir Duncan the Tall, who later becomes a member of the King's Guard, and his squire Egg, who later becomes the King of Westeros, Aegon Targaryen V. To date, the series has a trio of novels collected in the anthology, A Knight of the Seven Kingdoms, with many more planned for publication. This news occurred in 2016. This means that it has been eight years since we first heard of the possibility of this series. The Jon Snow series was announced in 2022 by George Martin himself. Unlike the Hedge Knight story, which was a suggestion, the Jon Snow story according to George Martin, was already in pre-production. So, even if it takes several years for this series to be confirmed, time will prove George Martin right again. But then, when will we be able to see the series? If it has already been announced, it means that we could already start seeing other announcements, such as the actors that will be joining the series soon. I believe it is currently in pre-production, and possibly several episodes of the series are already being written. During this week, we will possibly have more information about the current status of this new series, but if I could theorize about it, I think we could see it by the end of 2024, or early 2025, since at the moment HBO is focusing on the second season of The House of the Dragon. Tell me what you think about all this, do you like the idea of a series of The Hedge Knight? What other series would you like to see about this universe? And stay tuned to this channel as we will be explaining in the near future what we could expect in this series. And if you liked this content, I invite you to become a member of this channel. Each contributor will see their name at the end of all videos. And for more videos with theories, news, and stories from the Game of Thrones universe, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You are on. The Three-Eyed Raven